Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise Master Jesus. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. It is well with you. Now go ahead and begin to confess our sin. Begin to ask the Father to forgive whatever sin you've committed. Knowingly and unknowingly, indeed, in thought, in words, and action. With whatever sin you have committed, go ahead and ask the Father to forgive you. Because sin is abomination unto God. Children of God, sin is abomination unto God. So ask for forgiveness now. And once your sin is forgiven, direction follow. Direction follow. Success follow. Victory follow. Breakthrough follow. Anointing follow in the name of Jesus Christ. Anointing is the first thing that breaks the yoke. It is anointing that destroys yoke. Hallelujah. So I wanted to I wanted to begin to confess our sin right now. Ask the Father to forgive whatever sin you've committed. Go ahead, go ahead. Nonsense and nonsense indeed in thoughts and words and action. Go ahead. Holy Father, I bow down before you. I come before you with a penitent heart and bended near, asking to forgive me. Father, forgive whatever sin I've committed, knowingly and unknowingly, indeed in thought and words and action. Whichever way and manner I have sinned against you, Father, through my utterances, through my action, Father, forgive me and forgive the sins of everyone under the influence of this telecast in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, manifest your strength and our weakness. We can do nothing without you, Holy Spirit. We can do nothing, Father. Forgive and cleanse us, purify us and sanctify us, and make us holy again in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, mighty Father. For in Jesus Christ, mighty name we pray. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ we pray. Now, I wanted to quickly invite the Holy Spirit. Invite the Holy Spirit in this meeting. Because when the Holy Spirit is, is present, every other power give way. Every other power give way. Every other power submit. Hallelujah. Remember, I said at the mention of the name Jesus Christ, every nail shall bow, things or other things beneath the earth. Every nail bows. Hallelujah. So go ahead right now. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I invite him. Holy Spirit, I invite you. I invite you in this meeting. Take over, take over, take over. Take over this meeting. Take over, take preeminence. Take control in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit of the living God, I invite you. Come with the fullness of thy power. Come with the host of heaven. Come, Holy Spirit. You are my divine helper. You are my divine enabler. Where my strength ends is where you began. Holy Spirit, manifest your power. Father, thank you for, Holy, for sending Holy Spirit unto me at this moment. Thank you for sending Holy Spirit unto everyone, into every home, every home, every nation, every continent, every city that this broadcast is being watched or followed. Father, send down the Holy Spirit to touch every soul under the influence of this telecast and let their life be transformed. Connect them. Wherever they have disconnected Holy Spirit, arise and reconnect them to the Father. Reconnect them to the Son and reconnect them to yourself, Holy Spirit. Take over, take preeminence in the name of Jesus Christ. Come, Holy Spirit. In Jesus Christ's mighty name we pray. Now, can we sing these songs together? Come, Holy Spirit, we need you. Come, with a heart full of praise. Come with a fullness and power. I say, come with a whole gentleness, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, we need you. Come with a heart full of praise. Come with thy fullness and power. I say, come with the whole gentleness, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, we need you. Come with the heart full of praise. Come with thy fullness and power. I say, Come with a whole gentleness, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, we need you. Come with a heart full of praise. Come with a fullness and power. I say, come with a whole gentleness. In Jesus Christ's mighty name, we worship. 
Now, I want you to take authority in the name of Jesus Christ and bind every power of darkness. Bind them in the north, in the south, in the east, and the west. Bind them in the air, land, beneath the, beneath the sea, land, sea, beneath the sea. Wherever they have gathered against this meeting, against your life, against your ministry, against your faith, against the glory of God upon your life, against the anointing of God upon your life, bind them in the name of Jesus Christ, wherever they have gathered. Wherever they have gathered in the north, south, east, and west, in the air, land, sea, beneath the sea, go ahead and bind them. Bind them right now, bind them right now, bind them right now, open your lips. Remember, a closed mouth is a closed destiny. A closed mouth is a destiny, a, a closed destiny. So go ahead and open your lips and begin to bind them. Go ahead and bind them, bind them, bind them, bind them, bind them, wherever they are. Wherever they are, wherever they are, wherever they are. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead and bind them, go ahead and bind them, go ahead and bind them, go ahead and bind them. Bind every power of darkness. No matter where they are, no matter their level of operation, no matter the office of operation, bind them right now. Go ahead and bind them. Go ahead and bind them. Go ahead and bind them. Bind them. Bind them. Bind them. Bind them. Bind them. Bind them in the name of Jesus Christ. Bind every territorial power, every environmental power, every local power, every 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 continental demon, every international demon, every local demon. Go ahead and bind them right now. Go ahead and bind them. 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 Go ahead. Go ahead, children of God. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead and bind them. Go ahead and go ahead and bind them. No matter where they are, no matter the office of operation, go ahead. For the Spirit of the Lord is with you. The Holy Ghost is with you. And the, if the Father is for you, no one can be against you. Go ahead and take authority in the name and blood of Jesus Christ and destroy every work of darkness wherever they have gathered. The Bible is saying, in, in, they, they shall, surely they shall gather in Isaiah. He says, surely they shall gather, but not by me. Wherever they have gathered against my life against my family, against my ministry, against my finances, against my breakthrough, against my property, against everyone under the influence of this telecast. I scatter them in the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and scatter them. Go ahead and scatter them, children of God. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. No matter where they are, go ahead and bind them. Go ahead and bind them. Scatter them. Scatter them. Scatter them. They shall have no power over you. They shall have no power over your finances. They shall have no power over your ministry. They shall have no power over your prayer life. They shall have no power at all to torment you. In the name of Jesus Christ, go ahead and bind them. 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 In Jesus Christ's mighty name, we pray. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Go ahead, Holy Spirit, now. Go ahead and invite the Holy Spirit. Ask him that to, to, to set you free from every captivity, wherever you are, wherever they chain you, wherever they chain you. Whatever trap the enemy has set for you to fall in, go ahead and free yourself from that trap. Free yourself from every demonic trap, from every occultic coven, from every witchcraft coven, wherever they are, no matter the level, no matter the office of operation, go ahead and free yourself. Set yourself free. Set your children free. Set your family free. Set your ministry free. Set members of your ministry free. There are pastors that are connecting. There are prophets. There are bishops that are under the influence of this telecast. Set your ministry free right now. Set your ministry free. Declare freedom in your ministry. Declare freedom to your ministry. Declare freedom to your members. Go ahead and declare that. Declare, declare, declare to your family. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. So long as you are under the influence of this telecast, the Holy Spirit is saying you, wherever you are, distance is not a barrier. Set yourself free. Set yourself free. Iron sharp net iron. I am here to agree with you that your life will never remain the same. Your ministry will never remain the same. Your family will never remain the same. Your prayer life will never remain the same. Pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and pray. 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 Pray, 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 pray. Freedom is yours. Success is yours. Victory is yours. Breakthrough is yours. In the name of Jesus Christ, go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray, 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 pray in the name of Jesus Christ, the blood of Jesus Christ. Go ahead, 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 pray like never before. Pray like never before. Pray like never before. Pray in the name of Jesus Christ, in the blood of Jesus Christ. In Jesus Christ's mighty name we pray. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ we pray. It is done. It is done. It is done. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. It is done. They have scattered. They have scattered. They have scattered and your freedom has been guaranteed. Your freedom has been guaranteed in the name of Jesus Christ. In the blood of Jesus Christ. Children of God, I just want to touch something concerning the, concerning the, 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 the anointing. Anointing breaks the yoke. Anointing destroys every plot of the enemy. There are so many things anointing can do for you. So you need anointing to carry this race. You need anointing. Tell yourself, I need anointing. I need anointing to excel in this world where I am. Remember what Bible said, what Jesus said in John 17. 
He said, this word spoke Jesus and lifted up his eye unto heaven and said, Father, the hour has come. Glorify the Son of the Son, glorify you. Hallelujah. For I have given him power over all flesh. Hallelujah. To give eternal life to all that thou have given to him. Hallelujah. So go ahead right now. Ask the anointing of the Father to come to you. Ask for the anointing of the Holy Ghost. Go ahead and ask for the anointing of the Holy Ghost. If you are under the influence of this telecast, go ahead and ask for the anointing to destroy the burden, to destroy every yoke upon your life, every yoke upon your family, every yoke upon your business. Hallelujah. Anointing is what breaks every burden. Anointing is what destroys the work of darkness. Anointing is what destroys burdens. Anointing is what brings freedom. Anointing gives freedom. Anointing gives peace. Anointing gives joy. Anointing brings every God's virtues. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus Christ. That's what our Lord Jesus Christ said in Luke chapter number 4, verse number 18. Hallelujah. He quoted Isaiah chapter 61. So in that Luke chapter number 4, verse number 18, taking it down to verse number 19, he said, The Spirit of the Lord God is upon me because he has anointed me. Hallelujah. He has anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. He has sent me to heal the brokenhearted, to preach deliverance to the captives, and the recovering of sight to the blind, so that, to set at liberty them that are bruised, to preach the acceptable year of the Lord, to preach the acceptable year of the Lord, the anointing. And when anointing is upon you, when you preach, something happens. When you declare the, the, the word of God, manifestation of the power of God come forth. And powers of darkness are destroyed. Healing come. Breakthrough come. So you need anointing. Say to yourself, I need anointing. Say, Father, release anointing upon me. Release anointing upon me. And when Christ, when our Lord Jesus Christ take the Bible and begin to read that Isaiah chapter 61, you see the manifestation of the power upon him. He is telling you that he has not come to destroy, but he has come to build. He has come to elevate you and to teach you. That's why when he was living, he said, it is important that I go so that the comforter will come, the Holy Spirit that will be with you. Hallelujah. The Holy Spirit that will be with you. And he further said, to them that receive him, he gave it power to become. You need power to become. You need power to heal the sick. You need power to be free. You need power to excel. You need power to be successful. You need power to live. You need power to be protected. You need power. Say to yourself, I need power. So as we pray this moment, the power shall come upon you. The power to become. The power to achieve. The power to excel. The power to overtake. The power to recover shall come upon you. In the name and blood of Jesus Christ. In the name and blood of Jesus Christ. Remember what the Bible said in 1 John chapter number 3. In verse number 8 he said, For this purpose the Son of God was manifested. The Son of God was manifested that he might destroy the work of the devil. That he might destroy the work of the devil. In other words, the apostles, he said them, tell you here, in answer of apostles, tell you here until you receive power when the Holy Ghost has come upon you. When the Holy Spirit has come upon you. When, without power, you can do nothing. So you need power. Say to yourself, I need power. So this power is going to come upon you right now. When we pray, hallelujah, you will receive power to become great. You receive power to destroy that spiritual husband that has been tormenting you. That spiritual wife that has been tormenting you. That, that idol, that witchcraft power that have caged what belongs to you. You need power to recover. Remember, remember when David went out to fight, something very strategic happened. The, the Assyrians came and took everything that David had, including the wife, the children, the cattle. Hallelujah. And when David came back, he didn't find nothing. The men that went to war with David was very angry with him. They were upset and they began to say, oh, why did you take us out? If we were here, we would have fought them. No, no, no. This battle is not yours. It's of the Lord. This battle is not yours. It's of the Lord. You just have to commit yourself into, into it. Come in the Lord and invite the Holy Spirit to take over the battle. He will fight and give you victory. Today, victory is yours in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Victory is yours. Say, victory is mine. Say it again. Say, victory is mine. Say it again. Say, victory is mine. When God gives you victory, he gives you in totality. Victory over poverty. 
victory over sickness, victory over failure, victory over rejection, victory over stagnancy, victory over barrenness, victory over depression. Victory, victory, victory is what you need. And for you to get this victory, you need power. Hallelujah. You need power. You need power. In Greek, what is so called dunamis. You need it. Hallelujah. You need it. So, victory, when you have, when you have anointing, then you begin, to do ex you begin to excel. The impossibilities are made possible because for anointing. Anointing makes all impossibility to be possible. Hallelujah. Anointing brings trans direction, transformation, protection, increase. Hallelujah. Anointing has a lot of features which I'm not going to mention, be mentioning here. The anointing is what makes the spiritual walk and the spiritual warfare easy. It's the anointing. Hallelujah. Say, Father, anoint me now. Say, Holy Father, anoint me now. Anoint me now with the Holy Ghost. Lay your hands upon your head. Say, Father, anoint me. But anointing, let every power of darkness die in my life. But anointing, let there be light upon my life. Let there be light. Anywhere that darkness in my life, let there be light. 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 Let there be light upon me. Let the light of God shine 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 upon me. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Declare, say, I am that city on top of the hill that can never be hidden. I am the salt of the earth, I'm the light of the world. I am the candle on top of the city. No one can hide me. I have not been hiding. I will not be hidden again. Every garment the enemy have used in covering me, I pull them out. Go ahead and pull out that garment. Pull out that garment of shame, garment of reproach, garment of agonies, garment of death, garment of setback, garment of stagnation. Go ahead and pull it out. The anointing is upon you. Go ahead and pray. 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 The Lord have made you a prayer machine. Go ahead and pray. Pray in the name of Jesus Christ and the blood of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and pray. Pull out that garment of stagnation. That garment of shame. That garment of anger. That garment of immorality. Pull them out. Destroy that garment. The anointing of the Lord is upon you. Every yoke is broken. Bearings are lifting up their shoulders. In the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Because you have laid your hand upon your head, the anointing has come upon you. Because you are under the influence of this telecast, the anointing has come upon you. Pray, children of God, pray. I am your prayer partner. That anointing that is upon you, no one can destroy it. No one can destroy it. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Pray, 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 pray. Pray, 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 pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Declare and say, whatever needs to be changed in my life, let the anointing change it now. Go ahead and pray. Whatsoever that needs to be changed in my life, in my ministry, in my family, by this anointing, let the change come forth. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. You need a change. You need a change. You need transformation. You need to be renewed. You need to be, you need, you need it. You need it. You need it. Now that anointing is upon you, go ahead and pray. Say, my father, my father, whatever has to be changed in my ministry, let it come forth by this anointing, by this prayer, by this divine visitation, by this divine visitation. I am connected to LCP, life-changing prayer program. My life will change. My situation will change. My ministry will change. My family will change. My finances will change. My office will change. My business will change. Father, whatever needs to be changed, let the change come. In the name of Jesus Christ, go ahead and pray. The change is coming. Change is taking place from the foundation of your life. Change is coming. Change is coming. Whatever the Heavenly Father have not planted in your life, in your ministry, I uproot them right now. Go ahead and uproot them by announcing. Uproot, 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 uproot the spirit of anger, spirit of immorality, spirit, spirit, every spirit that enemy have projected into your life, uproot them right now. Go ahead and approve them. Go ahead and approve them. Go ahead and approve them. Approve them. Approve them. Approve them. Deliverance is taking place in your life. Deliverance. 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 
Deliverance, 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 deliverance. For the Spirit of the Lord is upon me. He has sent me to proclaim the acceptable year of the Lord. He has sent me to, 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 to set the captive free. To deliver you from every walk of darkness. Go ahead and pray right now. That deliverance is taking place in your family. In your family. In your life. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Children of God. Go ahead. Pray. 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 In Jesus Christ's mighty name we pray. Say every prosperity in the heavenlies. Calling my name in any occultic temple. Clear. In the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and clear them off. Clear them off. Destroy them. The anointing is upon you. Go ahead and destroy them. 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 In Jesus Christ's mighty name, we pray. Say every rebellious yoke upon my head. Rebelliousness is worse than witchcraft. Say every rebelliousness upon my upon my neck, on my house, in my village, in my ministry, be destroyed by the anointing. Go ahead and destroy the spirit of rebelliousness. Go ahead and destroy them. Go ahead and destroy them. Every rebelliousness in your ministry. Everyone that comes to your ministry is to uphold your ministry. Everyone that comes to you, good helpers will locate you. Helpers, divine helpers will locate you. Ebenisa. Ebenezer, Ebenezer, it means my helper is located you. Cry, cry unto the Lord. Children of God, cry unto the Lord. Cry unto the Lord. Cry unto the Lord. Cry unto the Lord for this is the day of day. This is the day you have made for you. This is the day that you are blessed. You are help, your, your way has to be blessed. You have to be blessed. You have to be blessed. Your ministry has to be blessed. Your family has to be blessed. You have to be blessed. Say, I have to be blessed. Go ahead and declare that. Declare, declare, declare in the name of Jesus Christ. Everyone that have caged you, everywhere you are caged, everywhere they are hanging what belongs to you, I'm releasing them to you by this anointing. By this anointing in the name of Jesus Christ. Every trap the enemy has set for you, I destroy them by the anointing. I destroy them by the anointing. I release your finances. I release your marriage. I release your business. I release you from every cage in the name of Jesus Christ. Wherever they have tied you down, be released, be healed, be set free in the name of Jesus Christ. Wherever they have judged you, I condemn them now. I set you free. He said, therefore now, no condemnation for them in Christ, that are in Christ Jesus. Romans chapter 8. Therefore now, there is therefore no condemnation for them that are in Christ Jesus. No one can condemn you. Any way that have judged you, I set you free. I set you free. I set you free from that captivity. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. In Jesus Christ, mighty name, we pray. Hallelujah. 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 It is well with you. It is well with you. Rejoice, 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 rejoice. Rejoice for it is well. It is done. 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 Rejoice. In Jesus Christ's mighty name we pray. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Can we quickly take Psalms 23? Today's day is 23, 23rd day of the month of March. Say, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie and bring past. He lets me start still water and restore my soul. Listen, the power of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of shadow of death, I fear no evil. For the heart me, that let us not stop, that comfort me. That prevents the table for me in the presence of my enemy, that anointed my head with oil. My cup runneth over, surely goodness and mercy of the Lord shall follow me. All the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the presence of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Hallelujah. It is done, children of God, rejoice. For the Lord have done it. The Lord have done it. Your life will never remain the same. So long as you have connected to this telecast, your life will never remain the same. Wherever they tie what belongs to you, I've released it and I've set you free. Hallelujah. I release peace in your marriage, peace in your finances, peace in your home, peace in your office, peace in your company, peace in everything that has to do with you, peace in the nation, peace in this nation of South Africa, peace in the all nation of the world, peace in all the continents, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. This is our year of shalom. Shalom means peace. I release peace unto you wherever you are. And this is our month of speed. The speed to overtake those who began who began before you. I release that speed upon you by anointing. I release that speed. I release that speed. Receive it now. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Rejoice for it is done. Children of God, it is done. 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 In Jesus Christ, mighty name, we pray. Amen. Amen. Listen, I'm gonna see you. I'll see you again by 12. Midnight. I told I said to you that every three three hours we have to pr pray this prayer. Every three three hours. Hallelujah. So rejoice for the Lord have done it. Cover yourself with the blood of Jesus Christ. Cover yourself, cover yourself, cover yourself, cover yourself, cover your family, cover your finances. For it is done. 
In Jesus Christ, mighty name we pray. Can I hear amen? Can I hear amen? It is done. Hallelujah. Now go ahead and like this prayer. Like it, like it, and share it. Like it so that others will benefit from what you benefited. Hallelujah. Tonight is going to be a prophetic night. I look at your name, I prophesy. I see your face, I prophesy to you. It's going to be a night of prophetic. I am looking at you, Flores, remember to connect. Nick, remember to connect. I want to see your next by 12 midnight. 12 midnight. Remember, Jesus Christ said, why can't you pray with me for one hour? Watch, I pray that you get not into temptation. In, in Matthew, Matthew 26, the spirit indeed is willing, but the, the, the flesh is weak. I terminate every weakness in your flesh in the name of Jesus Christ. It is done. Praise be to God. Praise be to the Master Jesus. It is done. Go ahead and share it. Like it. Like it. Like it. Like it. Don't leave this this forum. Don't like. Don't leave this forum under this telecast. Don't leave it until you like it and share it. And go back and recall what you have prayed before. Like them. Share them. Go to the YouTube. You watch it on our YouTube. You watch it on our YouTube. Prophet Isaka. Follow me. Hallelujah. And send me your testimony on Prophet Isaka at RafaTV.com. Keep on watching Rafa TV. Download it on your Android, on your phone. You watch it wherever you are. Hallelujah. Even on, at, on, when, on, on your way to work or in your office, put it there. Hallelujah. You watch it and you see the glory of God. Your life will never remain the same. Hallelujah. It is well with you. I love you. Remember to share it before you leave. I love you. May the peace of the Lord be with you. Shalom. It is well. I love you. See you again by 12 midnight. The Lord bless you. Amen.